Allegations of Russian interference in the U.S. election swirled throughout the campaign. A CIA report claims that Russian operatives hacked into Democratic Party emails and passed them on to WikiLeaks in an attempt to help Donald Trump win the presidency and hurt the chances of the Democratic nominee Hillary Clinton. The report has not been made public, but some U.S. senators were briefed on the intelligence earlier this week. It said uh, essentially three things. It said the, the Russians are behind this. Number two, the Russians are uh, leaking it. Uh, number three, it is intended to influence or uh, interfere with our elections. And number four, it was approved at the highest level of the Russian government. That is, uh, I find it pretty astounding. The White House says there's no evidence of any cyber attacks or hacking on election day that might have changed the vote tally or election results. Donald Trump's transition team slammed the inquiry, referencing faulty intelligence that helped lead the U.S. into war in Iraq more than a decade ago. In a statement, the transition team writes this, quote, These are the same people that said Saddam Hussein had weapons of mass destruction. It's now time to move on and, quote, make America great again, using a line from his campaign there. The U.S. has not publicly released any of the report or any direct evidence of Russian interference in the U.S. election. According to a U.S. intelligence source quoted by The Washington Post, the CIA does not have evidence directly linking the alleged hacking to the Kremlin. WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange says the Russian government was not the source of the emails, but he won't say who the source was. Russia has long denied having any role in the U.S. election. The Russian President Vladimir Putin commented before the U.S. election. Does anyone seriously think Russia can somehow influence the choice of the U.S. people? Is the U.S. some kind of banana republic? The United States is a great power. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Russia has called on the U.S. to make any evidence public. Jim Spellman, Washington.